I don't know. Fred had a lot of good seasons. So it's hard to say that this is his best, but the way he's getting the ball, uh, the way that he's communicating and running around, um, I mean, I, I can just from the start of the season to the now, yeah, I can say that it's probably one of his best seasons. It just, just looks like he's confident and having fun out there. So. Yeah. You mentioned uh, he was aware DK might do something like that, and his instructions were to kind of just sit there and, and let, let him get the penalty. He did a pretty good job of letting DK get the penalty. Obviously, I don't know where he got right, it. Right, right. Um, I don't know. Is that a savvy veteran understanding what's going to happen with a guy like that? Uh, I mean, yeah, uh, we talked about it earlier in the week. We're not really, I mean, I didn't see much what was going on. I just saw a big old pal. I was tired. So, <laughs> uh, I mean, yeah, we're expecting it from different teams and stuff. So, I mean, like I said, we're not trying to fight back. Yeah. Uh, so, yeah. yeah. Trey, when you're chasing down the one seed like you are, how intense does the focus have to be every day, every game? Right, yeah. I mean, you got to be intense and focused in this lead period because now you're going to get fired. So, I mean, we're chasing down the one seed, but... Uh, I mean, we're trying to just get better as, as players, as, as a team, and then that's going to come naturally. So, I mean, we're chasing it, but we're just trying to enjoy every day, every game, because you can't think too far ahead. Were you able to chase that balance and have fun at the same time? Chase that what? Chase that balance. The, the balance of chasing it, but also having fun. Well, balance of chasing what? You know, the, the one seed. We're just trying to win. Oh, we're fun. not chasing it. We're like, uh, we're just working every day, trying to get better every game, and then it's gonna come naturally, you know. I mean, if you chase something, you know, a lot of times you don't get it too much. So it's just, you gotta enjoy the game that you got now. And then once that time comes, you gotta be ready for that moment. Dre, Trent mentioned that he felt like the team still left him on the bones. Yeah, I think so too. I mean, they score some points and as a defense, you don't ever like when they score. And there's a couple of drives where they move the ball down pretty easily. So uh, there's still definitely a lot of meat on the bone. So, I mean, that just kind of tells you I mean, good kudos to them, man. Good job, Redown. They got good players too, but uh, there's still plenty more that we can get better at. What did you think of Mitch's fake punt? I thought it was great. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was great. I mean, Mitch can run, so he's, he's a good he's a good punter. So, I mean, I thought we had it, but fortunately we didn't. Jerry, I know you had to leave the game at a, at a point today. When you're seeing all those guys go down, what goes through your head on, on defense uh, just as you're watching your players on the side? Yeah. Uh, honestly, the only thing that was going through my head was like get my ankle and help back so I can get back out there. Uh, I really didn't notice. I saw a couple guys go down, no hard grades did and stuff like that, but I'm not thinking about like kind of like that. I'm just thinking about going on that field and getting healthy. Get a couple more for Dre. 